After being thumped 5-0 by Marseille at the start of November, Caen steadied the ship somewhat by rescuing a draw against Nice last time out. But they may have been a little wary of entertaining Bordeaux on Saturday, having been thrashed 4-0 in the same fixture last season. However, the Girondins have been on a miserable run of form since late September, picking up just two points from a possible 18. After conceding a last-minute equaliser against Marseille last week, Jocelyn Gorvanek would have been desperate to see his side get back to winning ways. Well, they had the first real chance of this game. Malcolm getting into the box here, getting on the end of Francois Camano's cross. The Brazilian still chasing his first goal since week nine. Lukasin Jovanovic, the next man to go close from a Malcolm free kick. Excellent save there from Remy Vakucha to deny the Serbian defender. And Bordeaux were made to rue those missed chances. The Khan took the lead against the run of play on 23 minutes. Ronnie Rodland with the ball in for Ivan Santini. And the Croatian international scoring for the first time since week seven. Fine header for his fourth goal of the season. And atoning somewhat for missing a penalty last week against Nice. Excellent ball from Rodland, who got the equaliser last week. Well, that was 1-0, and it could have been 2-0. Shortly afterwards, Adam and Beng with an excellent effort there from distance. Clipping out off the crossbar. So 1-0 the scoreline at half-time. Clinical stuff really from Kong. Santini getting that goal to put them ahead. Bordeaux playing well, but lacking a bit of cutting edge up front. Well, Bordeaux really should have equalised. Two minutes into the second half, Camano with the goal at his mercy. Can only find the crossbar after a good ball across there from Nicolas de Preville. Up at the other end, Julian Ferro trying his luck from just outside the area. Good stop from Benoit Costil. Goalkeeper who came through the Caen youth system. Well, Bordeaux thought they had rescued a draw late on. To Preville with another ball in from the right-hand side. Headed in by Alexandre Mondi. But as it turned out, the substitute was offside. The linesman getting this decision spot on, as you'll see in a second. Clearly beyond the last man. And so 1-0 the final score. A seventh win in 14 games for Con, who move up to sixth in the table. They have now won every game this season where they've opened the scoring. On the other hand, Bordeaux, who are now without a win in seven games, slipped down to 13th.